So I wanted to share something with you. I know some children, and even adults, will open the refrigerator because, you know, they want a little snack, and they will hold it open for quite a while while they just stand there and gaze into the fridge, wondering what kind of snack they can eat. Okay, so this is what I've come up with. I have this little dry erase board that is on our refrigerator. And I have a section over here, snacks. And this is just a wet erase marker. So, in this refrigerator, at the current time right now, for snacks, <coughs> my children, well, any of us, there are apples, grapes, carrots, and applesauce to choose from right now, just for a snack. You know, not like lunch or anything, because there's leftovers and other stuff in there for that. But just a quick little 10 o'clock and 2 or 3 o'clock afternoon snack, that's what we currently have. And whenever one of those is gone, I erase it. Whenever I buy something else, I add it. So that helps with that. Now that is not like all the snacks we have in the house. That is just what is in the refrigerator. Okay. So that has helped decrease the length of time the door is held open while my kids just stare at the fridge and what kind of snack can I have? They can just look there and decide and then reach in and get it. So it's much quicker and, you know, saves electric, right? The thing I did, because this board is so big, I went ahead and put a column, Produce to Use. And this is mainly for me, because I'll buy produce to use, you know, for a certain recipe, and I may not use it all, or, you know, I may use it for like two nights, you know, like have it scheduled for two nights, but then on the second night, I decide not to make that, and you know, sometimes produce goes bad. So this, you know, is just a in-the-face reminder, hey, you know, you have carrots, tomatoes, and lettuce that you need to use up before it goes bad. So um, <clears throat> so even if it's not on the menu for that night, you know, I'm like, well, we'll just have a little, you know, simple salad, you know, just to use it up. Okay. Another thing I have added is the bottom section called Azure. And I don't know if you're familiar with Azure or not. It's um, I pronounce it Azure. Some people say Azure. Anyhow, it's um, Azure Standard. It's a company, a bulk, healthy, organic food company based out of Oregon. And um, <clears throat> I order from them once a month. And so this is just my Azure list <coughs> of things I am out of. Like, I was out of yeast, um, elderberry extract, echinacea, tincture, and the tea, and molasses. So on my last order, I got the yeast in and the echinacea, but they were out of the elderberry. So on my next, my at the end of this month, I'll need to order the elderberry and the molasses. And so this is just like my Azure shopping list. Um, I will put a link to Azure in the description box if you want to find out more. But like I said, that's just my Azure shopping list. My actual, you know, what we're out of shopping list is right here. Um, but anyway. I just mainly wanted to show you this section for the kids, and um, oh, you want to see my cute little magnet? Look at this. See that old shriveled up woman? I don't know if you can read it. It says, what? No chocolate? Ah! <laughs> my mom got that for me when I was in high school because that is me. No chocolate? You're joking, right? <laughs> okay. Anyway. So I hope you enjoyed this video and thank you for watching.